Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is of course Jack and this is Lumber Tycoon 2 and today I am going to be showing you how you can unglitch, let's say, pieces of wood from the floor or the ground of your base. So when a piece of wood is like, uh, I think it's this one. Yeah, I have a piece here and I have a couple of pieces over there which are just stuck and it's the most annoying thing ever because some people tell you to drag it to the edge of your base. You try and drag it to the edge, edge of your base, uh, it's not moving. Even if I like chop this thing with, a, with an axe, I can't even, I can't even chop it. Like I cannot get this out of the floor. I can drag it along with me to that point, but then when it comes on to an extra slot, to another slot that I've purchased, because you can see, or you used to be able to, you think it's about there, you can see it. In any case, you can see a faint line just going along there. That is the separation between the piece, the two pieces, the two plots of land that you purchased. So you cannot drag it from that point there. However, I've seen a couple of people um, do this. I think it's actually code that showed me this glitch. Um, because it shows me most of the glitches. Um, if you get your blueprints out, so you just need a simple blueprint. Go into your floors. If you have a tiny floor, go and grab it out. Now, don't fill it in because otherwise you're going to lose the piece of wood. Unless you don't care about the piece of wood. Um, so if it's a piece of oak, then I wouldn't lose any sleep over it. But, you know, if it was a piece of end times wood or a piece of koa wood or a piece of blue wood, then yes, I would be a bit bothered by it. Take your blueprint and put it on top of the actual piece of wood that is stuck in the ground. And then on your keyboard, you just want to click R to rotate and then click T. R, T, R, T. T, there we go. Try and click B. There we go. Your wood is unglitched out of the ground. So this works a lot better in private servers than what it does in public because in private servers there's no there's no real lag unless you've got a massive base and not a decent computer. Um, exactly the same with this here. It does take a little bit of a knack. R, 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 T, B. There we go. It just sort of pops back up at the ground. Obviously, make sure when you're doing this that there isn't any blueprints lying around because, well, that would be tragic. This piece here is stuck in the ground, as you can see. Again, going to do the exact same thing. Tiny floor tile. Rotate. Turn. B. Grab. Out. Done. What's that? Two seconds. It's literally the easiest thing to do, and it solves such a big problem in lumber where you've got a massive base, loads of wood on the base, but you've got loads of pieces of wood that are actually stuck. But anyway, if you have enjoyed this video, guys, please remember to go down below, like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications if you want to be kept updated with my latest videos. My name has been Jack, and I will see you in the next one.